Hey guys, so uh, I wanted to make uh, this review because I could not find uh, another video about this uh, boxing bag. This is the uh, Adidas Pro Safety uh, boxing bag. So, um, well, uh, maybe a description of this uh, thing. So this is 150 uh, high and this is 40 centimeters uh, of uh, diameter. Um, this uh, the material is not leather, so it's uh, well they call it artificial leather, you know, some some kind of vinyl, uh, and well, uh, yeah, something to mention is that this thing is made in the Netherlands, not in China. So, uh, well, things in China, uh, things made in China, uh, do not uh, necessarily have uh, bad quality, but. Uh, at least to me, uh, this means that the salaries of the manufacturer uh, or the people that manufacture these things are adequate. So for me, that's uh, added value, right? But uh, but well, anyway, that's not uh, the point of this uh, review. Um, so uh, I got it on sale. I got it for a, yeah, a bit above uh, 250 euros. Uh, regular price is maybe 320 or something like that um, uh, and well something to mention is that this does not come with chains so it put some ropes there in the for the meantime um, uh, but anyway so uh, durability well, I don't know I don't think this is going to last but um, well let's face it Adidas, Nike, uh, Reebok, uh, all these brands do not make products to last you know it's just uh, they just make a products that uh, look good, uh, that work fine, uh, but that's about it, right? Uh, this uh, the feature of this thing is that it has some kind of foam, you know, like uh, around it, so that there, the shredded fabric is in the middle, and around it there is some kind of foam. Uh, well, it, it is soft. It is certainly a bit softer than a regular uh, heavy bag. But this is not for hitting it with the bare hands, you know, or uh, yeah, even the only with the wrappings. No way, no. The, you you need the boxing gloves for uh, for this thing. So yeah, it is a bit uh, softer. It might be forgiving if you hit wrong, you know, if you hit wrong the bag, uh, it might be forgiving, but but not that much, you know, and not like uh, to just go ahead and start hitting like this. I mean, without the gloves, no. Um, uh, what else? Well, do I think that this is worth it? Well, it's very expensive, you know, but uh, heavy bags that have a 14 centimeters uh, wide are expensive. So I could not find anything of that width under uh, 450 euros. This thing cost me almost half. Um, and in that sense, well, uh, if you want this, this size, uh, it's a good option. If you're going to pay, I'm going to say, if you're going to pay full price, like 320 euros, I would say, no, it's not worth it. I would say just go for the real thing, like real leather, uh, yeah, something of much better quality. Just spend the money because in the long term, I think it's going to be better. You're going to have a much better uh, heavy bag. If you get it on sale, like me, I think you won't regret, it, regret uh, buying it, you know. Uh, I think it is an okay heavy bag and uh, yeah well um yeah that's it i think this it it's fine you know just fine uh, like uh, like break even you know in terms of a uh, uh, cost benefit so uh, yeah if you have any questions uh, let me know and uh, yeah thanks for watching